What up, what up, what up, it's your boy Ultra Man. I'm finna wrap the Crash Bandicoot first multiplayer campaign details. So let's just get into that right now. So, uh, ooh, looking kind of crunchy there. Went straight to 140 BB. Oh, no. Let's boost that up a notch. Bandicoot right. battle. Okay. IGN can exclusively reveal the Bandicoot battle. Okay, can it, can it crispy up a little bit? That was looking quite crunchy. All right, there we battle. go. Battle. IGN can exclusively reveal the Bandicoot Battle Mode, hmm. one of two local multiplayer modes in the game. The Battle Mode allows two to four hmm. players to compete in two events. This gotta be an old classic multiplayer game, though. In timed races they say multiplayer, not co-op, so... Uh... And create combo a high-score competition to see who can score the most points from a level's crate layout. Both modes can hmm. be played with two, three, or four players playing as Crash, hmm. Coco, Fake Crash, and in her debut, Fake Coco. So let's take a look at what to expect. Fake Coco with the with the, at, the with the bushy Time eyebrows. Time trials have long been a staple of the Crash Bandicoot series, and Checkpoint Race turns them into a competitive back and forth marathon. Interesting. Up to four players. Oh so, yeah, it's like our little race. Fastest time across a level, but it's not just about reaching the end of level finish line first. As its name suggests, Checkpoint Race is a series of races to each checkpoint crate in a level. Whoever wins the most I think most you can only see the person the so when she was really, doing the, really well, the other person. Pass the level, controller too? Yeah, this is definitely an old classic way. As you race, you'll see a ghost of your past competitors working their way through the level. Okay, yeah, the past competitor, okay. I was just going to say that. And staying true to time trials of Crash's past, you can see him with a little silhouette. The for a number of seconds, which are labeled on the box, can be smashed to help give you an edge. But if smashing crates with reckless abandon is more your style, crate combo is the mode crate for combo. you. Again, the mode measures success from one checkpoint to the next, but speed isn't the only goal. You'll want to score the most points by smashing as many crates as possible, because hmm. with each successive crate you smash, the point value of each crate goes up, up to 32 points per crate. And while it's a bit surreal to see so well, he died. Rip to crate, your boy. you'll have to keep your combo up by smashing them as quickly as you can. In the first gameplay, you can see a meter in the lower right-hand corner. Hmm. If you don't hit any crates before the meter runs out, the point value resets to one, and you have to begin working back up to a higher point value. Your hmm. run ends when I oh my god, what's up? Who, who is this Coco? So they were trying to kill themselves. Point, keeping up your combo could be the key to victory. Stars are awarded between each checkpoint in descending order, so like checkpoint race, it's possible to have a bad leg or two and still edge out a win. Wow. Both of these modes are local competitive play only, and there won't be any online leaderboards. The game will keep track of your progress during a gameplay session, Whoa, but, but once you is, end a session, they're, they're, all of the progress really... will be wiped, so you'll have to restart fresh the next time you decide to play, probably with new friends who won't be as mad at you that you beat them the last time. Crash Bandicoot okay. 4 will also include a cooperative mode which will allow you and up to three friends to play through any of the levels in Crash Bandicoot 4, either in their normal mode or through the inverted mode, which is essentially the mirror mode of Crash 4. You won't have to wait long to mm. put your Crash competitive skills to the test because Crash Bandicoot 4 It's About Time comes to PS4 and Xbox One. Alright, that's it. I ain't gonna make it this long, so... Go on them out, y'all. Yeah, pass the remote. Yeah, that's straight classic there. Um, anyways, you know, I would just want to react to it to see how it looks. Anyways, y'all, I'm going on out. Peace.